Gantry Crane was inspired by the claw game that you may have seen. It, it's a robotic claw that moves around in a constrained area and this shaky claw goes down and tries to pick up a stuffed animal. It, it, it never works. It turns out there's a knob on the back of those things that allows the unscrupulous arcade owner to determine how effective it is. So you can turn that knob down and the crane will shake like this. It's horrible. You never win a teddy bear in that thing. We wanted to make that game bigger and deadly, deadly accurate. So this is a three foot by six foot XY table robot, a little bit like a router table or like a, CN, like a powerful CNC machine. It's operated by drill motors, which we bought for $20 at the, at the hardware store, hooked up to the computer and enabled this carriage to move back and forth in this flat plane. We decided to make a really dangerous robot. And because it's so dangerous, we don't allow you to touch it. Instead, you operate this robot using your hand. It uses what's called a leap motion controller, which is a camera that looks at your hand and figures out how your hand is positioned. If you turn your hand this way, the robot moves this way. If you turn your hand this way, the robot moves this way. If you tap your finger like that, that's a gesture. And this pneumatic claw goes <laughs> And the goal here is to send that pneumatic claw out into that world and capture these little balls that are rolling around in there. If you can drop that claw over one of those balls and then move the claw over to the hole, you get a point. We need your pledge. Please support the Steam Carnival. Thank you.